Shirai Sokta, meaning burnt city, was a major Bronze Age settlement located in Balochistan, on the border of Iran and Pakistan. Flourishing between 3200 and 1800 BCE, this urban center was a hub of cultural innovation and trade, showcasing the achievements of early Iranian societies. The inhabitants of Shari Sokta were descendants of Iranian Neolithic farmers, whose legacy shaped their advanced agricultural practices, urban planning, and artistic traditions. The settlement's layout, featuring well-organized residential areas, workshops, and cemeteries, reflects a high degree of social complexity and a thriving economy. The pottery of Shari Sokta is particularly notable for its artistic sophistication and cultural significance. Among its remarkable artifacts is a vase bearing a series of sequential drawings that depict a goat leaping toward a tree, considered the world's first recorded animation. This discovery highlights the innovative spirit of its artisans and their capacity for storytelling through art. The pottery, often decorated with geometric patterns and animal motifs, also points to the settlement's connections with neighboring civilizations, such as the Harapan civilization, Elamites, and the Oxus culture. These relationships were facilitated by Shari Sokta's strategic location along key trade routes, enabling the exchange of goods, ideas, and technologies. The city's trade links are further evidenced by the discovery of Harapan seals, Elamite pottery, and materials like lapis lazuli and turquoise, which were likely exchanged for agricultural produce and locally crafted goods. These connections not only underline Shari Sokta's role as a cultural crossroads, but also its integration into the broader networks of the Bronze Age world. Genomes of Shari Sokta's inhabitants are available and fall into two clusters. First cluster, abbreviated as BA1, is mainly of Iranian Neolithic farmer stock, while the second cluster, abbreviated as BA2, is strongly mixed with ancient ancestral South Indians. For this video, I gathered the genomes of eight inhabitants of Shari Sokta, three of them belonging to the BA2 cluster and five of them belonging to the BA1 cluster. I analyzed the genomes with my trait predictor tool for DNA analysis, which you can purchase using the link in description of this video. Six of the eight samples were male, and of the six male samples, five carried Y haplogroup J, 2A. One sample carried Y lineage L. The most common predicted phenotype was Indian with three samples scoring this phenotype, although a couple samples did also score stranded and East Alpinate as their predicted phenotype. Every sample had dark eyes, six samples having brown eyes and two samples having dark brown eye color. Every sample had dark hair, seven samples having black and one sample having dark brown hair color. Three of eight samples had olive and five of eight samples had light brown skin tone. Three samples had wavy, four samples had straight, and one sample had kinky hair texture. Four samples were predicted to have a Greek nose shape, and four samples were predicted to have a snub nose shape. Seven out of eight samples were predicted to have high odds of male pattern baldness. Five out of eight samples were predicted to be shorter than average. The inhabitants of Burnt City had an average predisposition to kidney stones, a very low predisposition to hemoglobin E disease as a group, and an average predisposition to migraine. One sample had a high odds for lupus, two samples had low odds of gout, and three samples had low odds of eczema. The inhabitants of Burnt City had a low overall predisposition to polycystic ovary syndrome, average predisposition to age-related cataract, and average predisposition to age-related macular degeneration. Two samples had high odds of epilepsy, one sample had high odds of asthma, and two samples had high odds of vitiligo. One sample had low odds of myopia, two samples had low odds of corneal astigmatism, and one sample had low odds of primary biliary cirrhosis. Three of the samples were predicted to be warriors, while only one sample was predicted to be a warrior, which reflects a predisposition to higher dopamine levels and lower stress tolerance. The burnt city inhabitants were predisposed to more D2 receptor sites, which leads to higher odds of schizophrenia and bipolar and lower propensity to no-go learning. Speaking of mental health conditions, the burnt city inhabitants had low odds of Tourette syndrome, low odds of ADHD, low odds of depression, but high predisposition to bipolar one. Two of the samples were predicted to have lower odds of autism, while one sample was predicted to have higher odds of autism. 
No sample carried European variant for lactase persistence. For samples were predicted to have lower levels of empathy based on OXDR genotypes. But only two samples were predicted to have higher levels of empathy. Regarding athleticism, the burnt city inhabitants weren't very athletic. Six of them carried the XX genotype in ACTN3's R577 X variation, and only one sample was homozygous for the sprinter allele. The burnt city inhabitants had an average predisposition to Alzheimer's and a high predisposition to type 2 diabetes. However, they also had a predisposition to lower BMI and lower odds of obesity. The burnt city inhabitants had low odds of ischemic stroke. They all had average odds of atrial fibrillation and deep vein thrombosis. They mostly had low odds of a wide range of cardiovascular issues. They also had lower levels of plasma homocysteine. Four of burnt city inhabitants had low odds of alcoholism, and four had high odds of alcohol dependence. The samples had a high predisposition to epithelial cancers on the basis of 8Q24 genotypes. They had high odds of breast cancer. One sample had high odds of glioma or brain cancer. One sample had high odds of thyroid cancer, and they had average odds, overall, of testicular cancer on the basis of KITLG genotypes. Regarding blood cancers, they had very low odds of polycythemia vera on the basis of JAKE, two genotypes and average odds of leukemia. They had high odds of allergies, and three of them carried risk variants for rare conditions. Two people carried risk variants for myosclerosis, which seems to have been prevalent among this group. The burnt city inhabitants had lower than typical odds of autoimmune disease on the basis of HLA genotypes. Nonetheless, some of them were predisposed to a range of autoimmune conditions. One sample had a predisposition to type 1 diabetes. Three samples had a predisposition to ankylosing spondylitis. Two samples had a predisposition to rheumatoid arthritis. One sample had a predisposition to multiple sclerosis. All of them had below average odds of syncope. Four samples had higher levels of vitamin D, and four samples had lower levels of it. Three samples had lower levels of LDL cholesterol, and five samples had higher levels of it. The inhabitants of Burnt City were predisposed to lower red blood cell count and longer telomeres, which predisposes them to longer biological lifespan. None of them had hemochromatosis, but one sample did have low iron levels, which may lead to certain health concerns. The most common blood type among Shirai Sokta's inhabitants is O, but one sample did belong to the B blood group and one sample also did belong to the AB blood group. Thank you for watching this video. All the relevant links are in the description. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like and sharing. Goodbye.